If she's not here, Barabbas, we may as well give up. I have not given up on reading your manuscript and the good varieties in this and even you have not given up. Uh, But an expert like you will find it in no time. The address the needs a tune up, and I could use the drachmi. <laughs> Help an old friend. Uh, right. For all time's sake. All right, all right. Just. Just keep your heat ons on. Not as quick as a fit anymore, is she? <laughs> Cyclops got a message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. Ugh. Time to get back in shape. Last week, this shit happens every week. I can't keep doing this. We are ready when you are, Captain. Wait! Wait for me, Cassandra. I'm all packed and everything. You're coming, are you? If you're going, I'm going. Kefalonia is the only place you've ever known. You'd leave your home? I would if it meant staying with you. you can't go where I'm going. I need to be alone. Who's going to keep you company? I'll be fine. If I can't come, then take Hara. Hara? My pet eagle. She's my friend. Mater gave her to me. But she'll be your friend now. And it'll be like I'm there with you. You know, to remind you of me. Thanks, Phoebe. But you have to promise we'll see each other again. I promise, you haven't seen the last of me. Just stay out of trouble until then. I will, don't worry. Okay, you can leave now. Phoebe! No, 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 no. Hello. Earth. Mother of all, I greet you. Aniazu. Thought these ridiculous costumes were a good idea. You! Get up here! The gods! 
have looked kindly on these, our champions. But there can only be one winner. Sparta! Yours is eternal glory. I haven't looked at this letter since Alkivia this sent it to me. Months ago. It sounded like someone was in pain. Well, it can sometimes be hard to distinguish between sounds of pleasure and pain. Had I known you were going to knock, I would have left my door wide, wide open for you. I can't look at the spear without thinking of Brasidas. This sculptor had nothing on Phidias. Sorry about that. How did you get past the guard? No one gets past the guard. Relax. Ericles sent me. Wait. Who wrote this? Messy, like it was scrawled on a bobbing ship. Just like the hand of Varnavas. Legendary treasure, eh? Seems more like Varnavas and Mirodotos thought I was on vacation too long. <laughs> Those two. All right, boys. Where do you want me to go next? Oh, the gods as my witness, I swear! Which one? What difference does it make? Uh. <laughs> all of them, I swear, all of them! I have never heard. So much fucking god talk from one man in all my days! <gasps> Let him go. No one on this island is allowed to say that word! Did he say Cyclops? Or did he hurt your feelings? I don't like it when people call me that! Um, oh, I didn't. I... But you're so fat. I mean, big and strong. And you really do only have one eye. My eye. Give it to me. Give it to me, and I won't kill Marcos for having you steal it. Give it to me! 
You want it? Forget it. when he saw my spear in that fee. It was love at first sight. We can talk later in private. Who's this? Just a simple pilgrim. He just saw the oracle. I couldn't help but ask if she's as glorious as they say. Well, is she? She left me with more questions than answers. That's the oracle for you. Is the spear of Leonidas? Uh, I may have mentioned you. Malaka, Farnavas, use your head. Well, it's just he seemed interested in legends, like you. I, I thought you might get along. How did? It... You know my spear just by looking at it? You're more than some simple pilgrim. All things in Delphi are more than they appear. Even I. My name is Herodotus. I'm a storyteller. Or I was. This war is forcing us all to new extremes. A tribute to Dionysus and to Marcus? He is a god of wine. Or so he says. Don't see fishes like you every day, eh? <laughs> oh! You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. What does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. What? A vineyard? Malaka! It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me drachmi, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. I was worried sick. The side club sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's beside the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine? I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. <laughs> is that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. <laughs> we meet again, my old cliff nemesis. What 
Peter! Nicolaus! Stop! Nicolaus! No! Nicolaus! Nicolaus, look at me! Look at me, Nicolaus! Stop! Don't listen! Your blood is tainted! Rid yourself of this poison! Father? The one you love is dead. My destiny is clear. And I won't let you get in my way. Alexios, listen to me. You are my brother. I tried to protect you once, and I failed. I will not fail again. This belonged to our grandfather. Cassandra, wait. Thank you. champion and tasty meal for the sharks I see it's all coming together we haven't come all this way to stand on the dock quite right should you ever need a personal sparring partner you a skinny little Athenian I'm the champion or gonna be Sparta <laughs> Oh, a pity your brain isn't as big as your muscles. Let's get going. <laughs> I need to be oiled. Before I go to the games. Well, I would have been happy to assist if you were in any state to compete. I like to be royal. Well, that's obvious. Yeah. 
Yunos. Oh. Come here. Gives us a hug. Surely he can swim. Well, looks like you're the champion now. I can't believe he's gone. Unprecedented. And you want me to compete in the Olympics? Stepping into a dead man's sandals? And testicles isn't even digested yet. Oh, come, dear Cassie. Show them what you're made of. And show me while you're at it. So it's gone. After all it's done for me. I'm afraid so. But your powers are not limited to the spear. Your oath as keeper of the staff makes your destiny much more complex. It's too dangerous to leave this place open. And you know it! You wouldn't understand. Your pride will cost us all in the end. It's not about pride. What good is knowledge if you curse all of humanity in the process? It's what you wanted to avoid in the first place. Sometimes it's better if we find our own path. We are not ready for the power this place offers. You're right. I cannot save humanity directly. But I can save it from itself. This is your burden now. Humanity's fate will be decided by the choices you make. I understand. Cassandra, choose wisely. Spear has no power, and I have to leave the world I know to find more of the things that took it away? Things that turned people to monsters? Yes, to stop more monsters from existing. You're asking me to leave my home, to leave everyone I love. It is a sorry fact, but that will happen no matter what you do. They're mortal. One day, they will die. 
Sometimes the face we show to the world needs to be one of strength, despite the chaos we harbor beneath. There's more to being the best than pure strength. That's an excuse for the weak. I'll show you who's weak. Well, at least the family is all together. I'll get more wine. <laughs> well, this has supplied me with plenty of new material for my next play. Cassandra killed the monger as an act of espionage. That's exciting. Write a scene like that. There's been no love scene yet. Let me provide that inspiration now. Beauty is short-lived. You may as well use it, Alcibiades. And to that, I raise my drink. To us, who have persisted through everything, and to those who wanted to persist. A tribute as good as your singing. And to the gods. Now, dear teacher, I think you should whisk me away for our private lesson. I'm afraid I haven't had enough wine for that, Alcabiadis. Then someone fill his cup. <laughs> <laughs> You have no idea what almost happened. I almost killed you. Oh, don't worry. I'm as sturdy as a military ship. Listen to me. I'm immortal. Get it? You are not. You make mistakes and you die. Gone. And you leave everyone else to deal with it. Truly immortal? Yes, immortal. Surprise. Oh, <laughs> I knew you had the God's touch! I can't thank you enough. After spending most of my life at sea, it would have been absolutely shameful to drown in a pot. Ah, where are my manners? I am Varnavas. Captain of the Adrestia. Well, Varnavas, I'm pleased to meet you. I'm Cassandra, Mistios by trade. <laughs> oh, but you're much more than that, I'm sure. What do you mean? When they forced my head underwater, I prayed to the gods. And when they pulled it out, there you were. You called, and I answered. Many claim to have blood of the gods in their veins. You're the first I actually believe. I have something for you, too. No. The spear! You knew what it was the moment you met me. But I've outgrown it. It's yours now. Careful. It's still sharp. I'll cherish it forever. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something. Uh. Herodotus! I'm fine. I'm fine. The stories are true. That is the spear of Leonidas. The hero's blade. Well, though I'm not one to refuse a gift, the, the gift of friendship is enough for me. You only want friendship? Eh. I guess I'll need to find another second in command for my trip. Me? Traveling the world? With you? If you'll have me as your captain. I don't know how much longer these old bones can hoist a sail. But I'll go as far as I can. The Adrestia is yours.
So, you have a ship? Of course. Gods forbid I'd end up stuck in this place. What is it now? Thanks to you, it's still in Sami Harbor, where I left it. Seeing as I saved your ship and your life, I'd say you owe me. Mind of a Mystheus. You know who you remind me of? Me! <laughs> a much younger me, of course, before I found my true purpose and lost my eye. You're changing the subject. Ah, yes. My apologies. You're right. I owe you my life. What could humble Varnavas do for the mighty Cassandra? I need a ship and a crew. <laughs> of course you do! So, that's a yes? My ship, my crew, and my services are yours. You truly aren't from around here. Ha <laughs> ha! Gods, no! And I thank them for that! Come now and see the Adrestia!